Hi, my name is Vincent and today I want to take a look at an SAT problem involving rates and proportions. So we have a pool is being filled at a constant rate of 4 gallons per minute. At 12 noon it is 6 25ths full and at 3.30 p.m. the pool is 40% full. How many gallons of water does the pool hold when it is completely filled? Now for a problem in the free response section we don't have the luxury of plugging in numbers to see if it matches an answer key. So we just have to extract this information and organize it well so that we could arrive at a solution. So if we look here, the rate in this problem is equal to 4 gallons per minute. So we're just going to write this off to the side. And then what we want to do, considering it's a problem involving time, we can make like a little timeline to map the change here. So at 12 o'clock, At 12 o'clock noon, the pool is 6 25ths full. But what we want to do is, since the next piece of information is at 3.30, the pool is 40% full, we should convert this to a percent. And this is easy to convert to a percent. You just multiply the top and bottom by 4, and this will tell you that the pool is 24% full at 12 o'clock. So if we look here, from 12 o'clock to 3.30, that's three and a half hours, 3.5 hours. But considering the fact that our rate is in minutes, we can convert this to minutes by multiplying 3.5 hours by 60 minutes over one hour. Or we're really just multiplying this by 60. And we know that we could also say 210 minutes. Okay, so 210 minutes went by from 12 o'clock to 3.30. But we also know that at 3.30, the pool is 40% full. So from 24% to 40%, that's a 16% change in percent from 24 to 40. So one thing we need to look at now is we need to know, well, how many gallons were put into the pool in three and a half hours or in 210 minutes. So this is where our rate that we were given is gonna come in handy here. So if we know that there are four gallons going into the pool every minute, if we multiply that by 210 minutes, that's gonna tell us how much water went into the pool in this time frame of 210 minutes. So we could cancel out the minutes here and 4 times 210 is 840, and that's 840 gallons. Now we have to be careful. We cannot call this our answer because this just represents 16% of the pool. Okay, so now we could set up a proportion on the side that 840 gallons corresponds directly to 16% of the pool's volume. But the question is asking us, how much water does the pool hold when it is completely filled? So we need to know how many gallons would be X gallons. We don't know yet. But when the pool is completely filled, that means it is 100% full. Okay, it is filled all the way. So then to solve for X, we're just solving a basic proportion here. We're going to cross multiply. And we're going to have 16 times X. We could ignore the percents and the units for this part. 16X equals an 840 times 100 is 84,000. We're just going to add two zeros. And for a question like this, you would most likely be allowed to use a calculator. But we divide both sides by 16. And 16 is going to go into 84,000, 5,250 times. So the answer to this problem, 5,000 250 gallons the pool holds. Okay, well this is going to conclude this SAT problem. If you found this video helpful, please click like and subscribe below and happy studying.